Ladies and gentlemen, it is your amazing host here. Once again, it is Team Rai. Have you seen the very first video of the day? If not, what are you waiting for, people? Anyway, follow me on TikTok, Instagram, Twitch, Twitter, my own Facebook page. The link will be down below. Hopefully, someone out there on YouTube or however you find these videos will be part of the Rara show for a future episode. Please message me, DM me, me there. I'll be waiting patiently. Okay, once again, I'll discuss for you wrestling news, wrestling topics, and a lot of awesome information to discuss for you. Now, if you like, sit back, relax, put your feet up, grab some meat, grab some drink. Now, if you don't like that, maybe you want to like a villain and hear my thoughts, my opinions, and the subject, and the course. The article will be down below, or the link will be down below. Once again, there will be a link. Let's get into this. Now, was it yesterday, or the day before, or maybe the day before that, there was rumors that there is going to bring back Samoa Joe. Not to main roster, but to NXT. So last night, for NXT, I think it was a special. I can't keep track of these wrestling Dates I, I used to, but anyway, he came out, so I guess he's not gonna be the new general manager and take over for Regal, he's gonna be an enforcer and help out Regal. So Regal will still be there, I think. I'm, I might get my information wrong, and that's awesome because that's awesome. I'm so glad that Samojo is back, I'm so glad that we brought him back. I think. Sure, boys brought him back into the company. I'm not really too sure, okay? I really think that Samoa Joe is better fit in NXT than the main roster. When they got called up to the main roster, what did they do? Then Triple H's bodyguard, he had a feud, a small feud with Seth. Then later on, he had these stupid feuds, stupid matches with Braun Strowman. Brock Lesnar, that's the time when he faced Brock, he should have been the Universal Champion, but of course, that never happened. I think in that time frame, he was injured left and right, and that's why W was afraid to give him the main belt. So when he got healthy, he faces Rey Mysterio for Rey Mysterio's US title. And then I think after that, a couple months later, he got injured again. It seems like he's always injured. Is it because he's older? Or is it because... I don't know. I can't... It's a freaky accident. I don't know. Maybe that be... That's why they'll be... They want to give him the main title. And that is BS. But whatever. So, I don't know. Then... When he was injured... <clears throat> we have not seen him on TV for a while. Until... I don't know where... He was doing... Com commentating for Raw. Then... Couple of pay-per-views. He did Mania. This past Mania. He's a rain delay for the first time, I think. I can't keep track. Then, before you know it, by the beginning, by the boom, they release him and other superstars. The other superstars, I could care less. They're not a big factor. A WWE, I'm sorry. And of course, WWE and McMahon never pushed them. Anyway, I'm sorry. So, the biggest shock. And the whole group got released is Samoa Joe. And I was so... I was so upset. So sad. Because... He was injured. And he was doing commentating with Michael Cole. And that mania. And then before you know it... We heard rumors that... Some people were going to get released. And boom. They are really released. So Triple H was very pissed off. And now they brought him back. I mean there was rumors they are going to bring him back. And they did. So hopefully he stays in NXT for a while until the proper thing for him in the main roster. Maybe he's going to stay with NXT for a while, like Finn Balor, until it's a good time to bring him up. So let's see what's going to happen. I wish him a lot of luck in his new adventure in NXT. Let's see what's going to happen. Hopefully he stays healthy. If he doesn't compete or do compete, stay healthy, Samoa Joe. Okay. After match, sorry, after much spe speculations or rumors, however you want to say it, Samoa Joe is officially back 
These are returned to Anoxy, I just say last night. This said from tonight, because this article from last night, my bad. So you could um, read the rest of the article, you could check out the video, and all this stuff. Now, I guarantee if it's a live audience, the place will be more crazier. But due to the, the what's going on around the world, you don't get that kind of reaction through a flipping computer, you know? Or laptop, or a phone, you know what I'm saying? But whatever, it's okay, it's okay right now. I'm wondering how much money they, they give Samojo to come back to the company. I was wondering. So, you guys could check this out for yourself. Check it out. Now, how long do you think Samojo will stay in NXT? For a few months, a few years, or permanently home for NXT? I would just want to know your honest opinion. Hopefully, I don't know. Whenever WWE wants to bring them up to the main roster, that will happen. It probably will never happen again because WWE will probably have butchers his character like they did it before he was injured. Okay, everyone. Stay safe. Watch your flipping hands. Enjoy the rest of your Wednesday. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. And don't forget, Friday will be my Hell in a Cell Productions. And now, this is the last pay-per-view before our live audience. The next pay-per-view will be Money in Pink with live audience. I'm looking forward to that period. I love Money Bank. Last year Money Bank it didn't really feel the same with no live audience. But now W is back on the road. Next month. I'm looking forward to that. It better deliver. Peace out. And once again enjoy the rest of your Wednesday.